Hello, welcome to Flower Juice. My name's John McDonald, and today we're gonna to have a look at making an arrangement using this wonderful container. Now, I was so lucky to be given this as a gift by one of my flower arranging friends, and uh, we all end up with lots of containers, and sometimes it's nice to give them away, but it's also really nice to get one. So I've got this beautiful vase, and it's really just quite striking in its simplicity. So I've filled it with water, and um, we're going to make something that you would have in your home. So just to give a bit of support within the vase, I'm going to add some of this flexible wire. So there are different ways that you could support your flowers within a vase. If you've got the time and the patience, then uh, you could use cross members so cross members are literally where you would use like a, a material like cornice. So we've got this cornice and you would cut it to go across and just wedge it inside. There is a danger with that though that they're quite strong uh, and if you really make it tight you can actually crack a ceramic vase. So be really careful if you do that. But it is a really interesting technique and a good technique to do. Uh, just to show you, what you would do is you would take a rough measurement, then you would have a flat side and then you would do uh, an angle. So then basically you can go in on the flat side and come up and you can hear that. So you can see it just wedges in across there and if you find that it's too long, so start long is you just take little bits off on the flat side every time. So, so using the wire actually is a bit of a, bit of a cheat but it's not a problem, uh, it works really really well. So what I wanted to use in here were these lovely pieces of cherry and um, this just literally came off my cherry tree outside and I thought this is just perfect to create a bit of a line and this line is giving us a contrast with our vase. So again they're actually going to give us a little bit of a, uh, an ability to hold things as well. So what I've got, I've got lovely gerbera and I'm going to put the longer one more to the back and I've got a little shorter one here. So straight away we could actually just do an arrangement in this vase with just a couple of flowers. But I also have some beautiful roses and I wanted to just use these as well. I think actually this, the red, works beautifully with this container. So we can go in different directions with this. I'd really like it to be quite, quite angled would be great. So remember you can cut the stem as well just to lie flat onto the surface of the vase. And there we go. I've really brought this rose forward to give us a bit of depth. So really we've got depth with the material coming forward but we've also got a little bit of depth at the back. And if we wanted we could add just a touch of something else 
just to bring the eye further back. And there we go. A simple but really effective arrangement, literally using five flowers. And it's all about the vase, but it's thinking about the lines and how the material's sitting. So keep an eye out for fantastic containers like this and keep in with your flowery friends in case they give you a vase as well. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed today's video and if you'd like to keep up to date with all our videos, click here to subscribe and tap that bell and that'll give you a notification when we've got a new video out. See you soon.